Horse hide, raw hide, steer hide, and suede. You name it, and you'll find it at Zach White Leather Company in Ramser. We carry elk, we carry uh, bison, we got uh, goat, we got um, deer. I mean, and, and they, along with a cow and a horse. The scent of leather fills the air inside the warehouse, stocking more than half a million square feet of leather. Rolls of light and dark leather fill the shelves, and sheets of it are draped over railings around the store. And we sell to people that from making, um, recovering books from uh, the tack industry, the holster industry, people making holsters and knife sheaths and that kind of stuff. Tim Cox owns a store in hand cuts. Designs. But once we hand tool a design and make a design, then it's transferred to a plate like that. And that's stamped into the belt. And creates. That's hand tooled and hand painted. Just about everything out of leather. The antique looking machines help get the job done, but there is a lot of handwork in the industry. So you get your hands get dirty. Especially when Tim dyes the leather. It's a, like a four step process. His training allows him to make repairs to handbags and other leather items and create custom pieces for customers, which can take months to finish. His main business. To the wholesalers. We supply a wide range of um, crafters and people that in this business with supplies, leather, and tools, and that kind of stuff. The company has been around since 1933, which makes them unique. As there's only a few places in the United States that you can walk into a store and find this variety. Leather tools, conditioners, and dyes for beginners, all the way up to professional products. If you buy stuff online, you don't know what you're buying. Leather is something that you got to look at and feel and touch, and they can do that here. So if you have a project, Tim and his team will cut the pattern, provide the leather, and you put it together. Daniel Pierce, Fox State News.